on people been a long time how we doing see blue back here all right got the dodge check it out we're on graps now leveled it out looks good put a picture up here right, welcome back i got a little surprise for you guys today it's a little short video just to show you what i got going on now uh i picked something up yesterday and she bad but there's uh, there's one problem it's not running this minute it was running but i picked it up and something happened when i went to go get it and went to go ride it but it's a working rig if you get where i'm going but um right now i'm in the back of the truck picking up some zip ties oh hey man can't be in that guy's driveway uh Got some zip ties and the snips, but take a look what I got. There it is, on the 200X. All right, full suspension, front and back, beautiful, clean tank. But this ain't your normal 200X. Normally there's a kickstart right here. This is a 200S put in a 200X. This is a Frankenstein of all bikes, I swear. This is like a 87 tank. 85 frame, 84 or 85 motor. Um, this thing is clean. All right, I got videos of it running. some love i already diagnosed this i think it's just that's loose but big old 22s on here yeah they're dry rotted but we can fix that up um clean exactly the same motor i had in the other bike pole start works great it actually connects uh look at the big old shock back here now we gotta actually can take jumps and have no problems big old front tire 23s i think Yep, 23s with 22s in the back. Where it's at? Oh, they're 20s. Even better. So we can wheelie, probably. Got an 85 headlight. The plastics are, I, from what people are saying online, I asked about. Sorry, I was trying to clean them out. It's got an 85 seat, which I already found covers for that because it's got a bunch of holes. These are like 86 or 87 250R plastics. So, it really is a Frankenstein. Right now, I'm just cleaning it up. It was all dirty. Look how shiny the tank cleaned up. Looks good. A little bit of rust in it, but kind of see in there. But it's got a, that's what oil or gas filters are made of, <laughs> made for. I'm gonna get new bars from work. Front hydraulic brakes, big old disc. Got a disc brake for the back as well. I can order the caliper for it so I can run the brakes here's the whole setup right here but it doesn't have the pedal for it yet i don't know why they took it off but i need to fix this as well i think some heat and uh a vice that thing will freaking bend back in perfect shape check the oil since i'm right here yeah it's a honda maybe i probably change the oil eventually um the cdi box needs to get replaced we put my pulse generator from the 200S into this thing and it works better because the pulse generator went out in this. And the last thing we have to worry about was the uh, CDI box. So I got one coming in tomorrow. So the boots look pretty clean for what, how, I don't know how old they are, but yeah, they're dirty, but they don't have no ribs or tears in them. So that's good. Forks look good. I mean, probably could be rebuilt so i mean it's clean for what it is i mean <laughs> i like the wire ties all right i'm sure i can get a pipe all right eventually suspension very responsive but it's just a short little video for right now i uh, put the plastics on for you guys just to see how 
what it looks like. Yeah, it's they're old, right? <laughs> but I'm gonna fix them up my best I can. Do a good old zip tie stitch on them. And uh, yeah, it's the new project bike. But it, once it's going, it's going. So I want to post the video out, and get it out there, and show you guys what's what we got going on for now. Uh, hope you guys enjoy the little sneak peek of what we got going. And uh, hopefully next video, I'll be out riding it somewhere. I don't know where, but hopefully soon. Thanks for watching. See you later.